Holy shit, dude. The Humvee on our right. Humvee on our right. Yeah, yeah, I see him. I'm gonna kill him. And then all these guns, grenade launchers. Hey guys, and welcome back for another Daisy video. Today, you're gonna see some exciting encounters my duo and I got into on the Freshly Wiped server, Daisy to Come. We quickly took control of things and got into some good stuff, so make sure to watch the end so you don't miss any of it. Also, I'm working on another story, so you guys can expect another video pretty soon. And thank you for all the recent support, the subscribers, the comments, all of it. I really appreciate it. But with all that being said, let's get into the video. The server wiped a few days ago and that means a lot of the building spots are available. I knew exactly where I wanted to build for this adventure so my duo picked me up and we made our way to that location. Alright, just take this road all the way down, I'll guide you. Don't stop. All the way to the end. There were a few decent spots to build in this town but I decided the clock tower to fit our needs the best. After clearing out the zombies, I placed the tent I found and stored my loot. Afterwards, Pascal got off and I headed to Trader to buy some building supplies. And since the server just wiped, everyone gets one free kit so I made sure to cash that in as well. I stored the extra building supplies and began securing our tower. I wasn't going to go crazy on the building right now, I just wanted to block the bottom stairs and secure the top room as well for loot. We can always upgrade and add more gates later. All right, the bases are done. Now I just need some planks. Okay, bottom floor secure now. Oh, nice sheet metal. I can use this for the loot room. Okay, first gate for loot room done. Boom, another gate done. I think that should be okay for right now. Cool, we got some tents down. I finished securing base and as I finished up base, I was met with an interesting message on Discord. I won't say their name, but this person was screwed over by a bigger faction on the server and lost a lot of their loot and vehicles. I was looking for people to kill and he was looking for revenge. So he sent me their base location and Pascal and I made our way over to see if we can get our hands on any of the loot. Yep, the base is right here at Radio Tower. Uh, I definitely see building. Someone from building here. I don't see anyone right now though. I'm gonna push to this pub though, right now, and see what's in these tents. Okay, I'm watching outside. Oh, an AUG, a fucking thumper. Dude, this tent is packed. Uh, dude, they got two more AUGs. Oh, they got four landmines. 60 round mags. All the truck shit. Okay, I'm right outside the pub with you. Okay, the truck has a plastic explosive with a lock in it. But same thing, right? Ooh, some hazmat stuff. We can use this to go to the vault. I got the IV. I got a bunch of mines and grenades in here too. I'm gonna load this truck up. Yep, I'm down. Let's do it. We decided it was best to fill one of their trucks with loot and bring it home with us. These guys were online and left their base unlocked like some rookies, so we wanted to make them pay for their mistake. I covered Pascal while he loaded the truck with the best guns and loot, and then we made our getaway. There's another truck, dude. Yep, I see it. Keep going. I'll loot it. I looted this truck that was close to their base and if I had to guess they hid this one as well. Afterwards I met up on the main road to get picked up by Pascal and with a truck full of loot we made our way back to base. That was good shit dude. Let's go back to base. We made it back to base and dropped off our loot. We wanted to be quick about this because our plan was to head back in the truck to see if we can grab anything else. Okay, this is most of the loot. Some of it's upstairs in the tent. We stored our loot and began to drive back to their base. On the way, we encountered a couple of street pirates who weren't looking to be friendly. Holy shit, dude, a Humvee on our right? Humvee on our right? Hey, run this motherfucker off the road, bro. We're broken, dude. We're broken down. We're broken down. We're broken down. We can't move. We're done. Alright? Get out right now. Fuck, dude. My door's not opening. My door's not opening. 
I'm on the hood, move. I'm moving and stay right. Hey, I'm pinned down, I'm pinned down. I need help, I need help. I'm trying, I'm trying. Got him. Fuck, he hit me, I'm moving back. Yeah. Oh shit, he's peppering me. He's peppering me. He's over here. You can see us. Where are they? Right in front of us. On that bus stop. Okay, let's push back to red brick. I don't have enough bandages. Here. Get this one. Okay, I'm pushing out. I'm gonna flank all the way around. I got him. I got him. I got him. Nice, I'm pushing up. Damn, so his friend just took the Humvee and bailed? That sucks. Uh, we survived the highway robbery, but our car was ruined in the process, so we we're back to being on foot. We pushed back towards the base from earlier, and all I'm gonna say is things got loud very quickly. Oh, yep, two guys, yeah, two right guys there. right here. Right there, stop, stop. Right yeah, yeah, I see him, I'm gonna kill him. One dead, one more at the hood of the truck. Oh, got him. That was a headshot. Is that you? Yeah, it's me. Come loot their bodies. I'm going to cover you. I hear someone. Yep, else. I see him right here. He's full dead, too. Keep looting. I got you. I'm going to push up into the tree line. Okay, you push back. I'm going to push up and loot. Yep. Right here. I hit him. I hear a oh, guy I behind him. me. I hit him once, but I'm fucking. I did terrible. I end. Another one dead. Is that you shooting? Is that you shooting? No, it's not. Okay, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. Hold on. Brown ghillie suit hit. Brown ghillie suit hit. Got him, I think. Double tapped him. What? No! He just killed me. Ah. Where is he? He's on the um, thing. I thought it was you. Okay, he knows where I'm at, so I'm just gonna push around and grab a different angle and see if I can catch him. I flanked around and I managed to find a pretty decent angle. Yep, that's him right there. Okay, bro, just stay still one second. Got him. Brand Gilly suit dead. I managed to kill the ghillie who killed my duo, but there was even more of them logging in, so I pushed away to safety. The server is started and I couldn't grab any of the loot, and to top it off, the faction put a 60k bounty on my head. This bounty would show my exact location, so if I went back to base, they would know where I lived. So I decided just to head back up and fight them to get rid of this GPS. Yep, look at him. He's checking the bounty location. I could flank him. Damn, there's two of them behind me. Oh well, I knew there was a lot of them. I ended up getting surrounded and met my end, but it didn't matter. We already got a good chunk of loot from them and I went back to base to look at our loot and to get rearmed. Okay, so we got an IED with plastics and then all these guns, grenade launchers, the protective cases have plastics in them. Just more guns, landmine, ammo, mags. We honestly got a lot from these guys, and we didn't even have to use no explosives for any of this. <laughs> After returning to base, it was late, so I decided to get off for the night. And the next day, I was greeted with some unfortunate news. So according to the staff team, an old admin who had access to the back end of the server decided to sabotage the Discord and DayZ server. So the admins had to make a new server, and as of now, the server is running under the name Daisy to come 2.0. But since it was down for a few days, I hopped over to the Double Tap server and tossed down a small base in Cabinino. My plan was to take part in their most wanted PvP event at Airfield. I think that most wanted event just started. 
The objective for this event was simple. All you gotta do is find and kill an NPC and you get rewarded money. However, there was a bonus objective and if you kill anyone at Northwest Airfield, you get a 20k reward. And my plan was to go to Airfield and kill as many people as possible. Yep, that's them shooting. I felt like I heard shots over here too somewhere. I'm not sure though. Bro, that dude was just sitting in a bush. Dude almost gave me a heart attack, man. Let me hurry up and check what loot he has, though. Looks like just a PvP kit, nothing crazy. Okay, I'm gonna fall back to a bush and try getting some health back. Okay, I can run at full speed now. Fuck, I heard him at the last second. The event was still going on, so I spawned back and rearmed at base. Then I pushed the airfield. Yep, they're still over there. Oh, there's a dude right here. Okay, he's down. Looks like just another basic kit. Some good stuff though. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, that's right over where I died. Wait, I see him down. Do we trade? Dude, I don't even know how I didn't even see him there. He was just laying there looting the whole time. And now he's dead. I need the bandage. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can grab some loot real quick. Okay, this dude didn't have much, so I'm gonna just head out. Man, I'm hurting. There's a dude right here. He's down. I really shouldn't have pushed up to his body, but oh well. <laughs> yep, I knew that was gonna happen. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I know this video was shorter than usual, but I've just been busy the last few weeks. I'm working on a new video and plan to drop it soon. So thank you again for watching till the end, and if you enjoyed, consider dropping a like and subscribing.